Hold on, y'all. Hey, y'all. It is Tuesday. I am exhausted. I got eight hours of sleep last night, too. I went to bed at eight o'clock, got up around four or five, my normal time. That's why I, what time I get it up for. And I am exhausted. I haven't been sleeping. I don't know what's been going on. Maybe it's my pillows or something, but I've been waking up either my back is burning. Today, my entire neck all the way down to my shoulder is burning. I took my nerve medication. I am so ready for these girls to be off, y'all. Like seriously, I cannot wait. Hold on, my refrigerator's open. I spent the better half of my morning between four and five looking at videos on women who have had breast reductions. I primarily wanted to look at women who, what does it look like around the fourth or fifth month recovery because I'm gonna be traveling around that time. Granted, I think I should be okay after a few weeks. Um, this is not my first time at the rodeo, so to speak. This will be my fourth surgery. I've had um, two ovarian cysts removed. They were so large, they had to remove them. I've had a DNC, that stands for dilate and clean due to a miscarriage. I've had a C-section, and now this is a breast reduction. And so, all of my recoveries for those surgeries went fairly well. Um, so I'm not nervous because I know a lot of people are very get very nervous when it comes to surgery. I'm not nervous about this, but I did just call the plastic surgeon because I want to schedule another appointment because when I saw him, if you, if y'all can remember, that was months ago. That was back in September. So I said, I'm not nervous. I've been ordering the stuff I need to order. So I got some groceries here. I need to put on my groceries, y'all. Today I'm gonna be cooking my favorite meal. Um, my all-time favorite meal, it used to be chicken. Fried chicken, preferably. But my favorite meal is fish, collard greens, and yams. I prefer fried catfish, but since I'm trying to eat healthier, salmon. So, have y'all seen me make that before? Salmon, collard greens, and yams. That is my favorite, that is my comforting meal to me. Um, certain type of way. I'm gonna make myself a sea salt and coconut oil scrub. I hope and pray that this child goes to bed early um, because I plan on soaking in some Epsom salt doing a scrub to almost detoxify my, I feel like, I feel sluggish. I feel like I slept but I didn't get any sleep. You know what I mean? So yeah, I'm gonna have me some peppermint tea and really try to calm down. Look, do not sleep on your grocery stores. Anyway, let me show you guys what I got. First of all, this is the Honey Infusion Shampoo and Conditioner. Look at the price, look at, let me tell you something. I went crazy like I was on them. Remember that show, Supermarket Sweep? I pushed all, I mean, I just pushed, got one hand and swooped all that. <laughs> so I got three shampoos, three conditioners, um, and I'm more than likely, I like to make a co-wash quote unquote for my husband. So I'm definitely going to refill his little container up. Then they had tons of little bar soaps and bar soaps. And now that I'm thinking about it, I probably should have gotten all of these, but this is a good deal. You have the kiss my face, olive and lavender soap 109. This is a pretty big bar. I love lavender soap. I got some black soap, Crescent beach lavender, black soap for 169 and then I got four moisturizing beauty bars 119 I'm gonna go ahead and make me a Himalayan pink salt coconut oil scrub with some lavender oil I may do this stuff while JB is still up
Can y'all see me? You probably can't. Let me put it right here. Ooh, can y'all see me? Y'all can't even answer me. Bag, even if you can't. Let me just hold the camera, girl. So I'm in the Walmart parking lot. Oh, it's hot. I'm in the Walmart parking lot. And um, there we go. There we go. I'm hungry. Hold on. I need to go pay JB's tuition. And he's going to the zoo next week. So you gotta pay for that too, girl. Um, but y'all, I was gonna come on here initially because I have been having a, a week. But God, God has a way, God has a way of putting people in your life and making you reevaluate yourself, basically checking yourself and let you know, just basically it's called humbling, girl. Sit your ass down and humble yourself. So in Walmart today, been here for about an hour. And even though I am an introvert, you guys, I will speak to people who I find interesting. So um, while I'm here, I saw a woman with a beautiful baby and I, I heard the baby just being happy and I heard her doing her little baby talk to the baby. So as I came around the corner, I see him absolutely adorable, round, chubby, eight months of chubbiness. And so I spoke to the baby and I said, is this your grandbaby? She's like, no, actually this is someone's child, a friend that I keep. And she looked at me and I could tell her eyes were so bright. She was just so full of life. She basically was saying how this baby has changed her and her husband's life. She was just miserable. And ever since the baby has, you know, been born, her friends, she offered to keep the baby. And she's not depressed anymore. And she's, I mean, I could tell that was her testimony that she's just a changed person. Her husband comes on early just to pay with this, play with this baby. Their grandparents, all their kids are grown out the house, you know, and their grandparents themselves, like I said. But to have this new baby and new life. It just changes. And I was just talking to her and listening to her say this. I was feeling better. I said, you know what? I'm in some pain, but I'm kind of feeling better right now just for you telling me this. We're at our favorite place, the Goodwill. Uh, JB's putting on Mardi Gras beads. And two necklaces. They've gotten a lot of stuff in. Why don't you come over here and look at what they have? See if you can find some more tracks, baby. Over here, too. I'm going to see. Y'all, I'm looking for like cast iron. Skillets and um, because the old ones are better because they're all seasoned, yeah, baby. And I like to look for different type of uh surfboard pieces. Hold on, baby, let me look at you. Okay, you can look at that. I'm not seeing that. That fish plate, this fish plate, this is pretty. This is really pretty. This is really pretty for serving. How much is this? $3.99. I'm gonna keep my eye on that one. That's cute. Yeah, they have a lot of good stuff here today. I'm gonna like box of grams. Look at this basket. This basket is adorable. Come on, baby. Uh-uh. These fit and they're very cute. Mary Jane. Very, very cute. I have my hat. Have your hat? Yeah. Is that the hat you want to get? Mm -hmm. And, like and that, that man gave me this. That man gave you that ball? A yeah. nice man? Yeah. Yeah, see, there's some cookies. Oh, look, baby. She has pictures of cookies. See that? Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. 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 See all those? This is one dress. I really do like this dress. It zips up here on the side. And I can always pair a belt here to take me in. And yeah, really cute. Hits at the knee. Let me get up close. It's pinstripe, if you can see here. Really, really cute, right? This is the other dress. It's too big. Way too big. And honestly, I have one that's like it. This is how it's supposed to fit. See, way too big. All this fabric. Dress right here is bad. This dress is serving me Chanel late, or actually early 90s Chanel. Look at this. I mean, besides that right there, that's clearly not Chanel, but just the pattern alone. This is like a size 10, which I'm not. Oh, we are home. We have officially been out for three hours i am exhausted though y'all so 
I went out feeling a little dizzy. I probably shouldn't have done that, excuse him. Um, that, that second doses of gabapentin gave me a little dizzy, but it knocked down the pain to where it's simmering. It's not that bad, but my body needs to rest. I'm gonna go take me an Epsom salt bath, my country ass. First of all, sorry, before I do that, look at this. K Designs, let me, pull, let me pull you up sis. One of my subscribers, y'all I'm so sorry, JB. Um, she messaged me a couple of days, I think it was two weeks ago, and told me that she had um, the main choice biotin infused styling gel. I opened it up, I like this. Ooh girl, ooh. I opened it up, it's a little runny. I'm tempted to do a wash and go. I ain't gonna do that. We're gonna do flat twist. We're gonna play it safe. My husband this morning was like, uh, he said he likes french fries, referring to JB. Then I guess we're gonna go. We can go to Dave and Buster's all day, and then later on, um, we'll go out to eat. I said, Do you not remember? I have traffic school. And he looked kind of, you know, um, bummed out. I'm like, I sent you the information, you know, weeks ago, and I've told you, hey, this man don't listen to me. Child, so I said we can go Sunday at the church. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Sunday morning. A jello. JB's having jello for breakfast. Don't judge me. You can if you want to, but that's okay. Um, I think it was how I've been sleeping. And so last night was the first night. I looked at a couple of videos. Last no, no, the night before I felt way better. So I slept with my legs propped up. Okay, my legs elevated with one pillow. Um, yeah, I feel a lot better. What's going on? Last night we went to Papa Do's. We went out to eat as a family for the first time in like a year. The last time we went out as a family, you know, JV, y'all seen JV and I go out to eat, but as a family, we all sit down because typically whenever opportunity we have my husband and I go out and it's just that I've been telling him the times that JB and I go out sometimes he's okay sometimes he's acting a hot mess but Papa Do's those of you who are familiar with Papa Do's Papa Do's can be a very loud restaurant so it's loud I make sure we sit at the bar to where my husband entrapped him so he couldn't get up but no he did good he did really good so we were like okay and daddy trapped me he trapped him in so he couldn't get up because normally when we've gone out him and i together me and jb and i if he sit if we're sitting at a table um he'll get up not walk around but just get up you know do a little dance and sit back <laughs> Girl, he's five years old. Then he was four, you know, and sit back down. But he did really, Lord, he did really good today. So, and then I had traffic school all yesterday, girl. But you know what? Yet again, God placed someone in my life. There was a woman there who's actually she sat right next to me, and I had on all purple. And purple's my favorite color. She was like, you know, purple's my favorite color. I said, like, oh, me too, girl. But um. She asked me, because, you know, they give you an hour lunch, and she asked me, she's like, um... Look at that. Stop it, baby. She's That's like... like that, okay. You can show it to them in a minute. <laughs> um, long story short, she was giving me some advice <laughs> on changes to my diet mm -hmm. I need to make, because I told her I was getting feeling <laughs> sore and fatigue and inflammation. <laughs> And she's like, you really need to look into plant-based. This is yet again, like the second or third person that have came into my life and telling me that I need to make some changes. Yeah, I have a diesel one and a parsley one and a Gordon one. Show them closer of your fidget cube so they can see. So how does this work, pumpkin? It works like this. It goes like then, then, then. Where did daddy find the child? When he and at CVS. Well, he's with my husband. My y'all think I spoil him? My husband spoils this child. He, your husband better spoil me. What? Your your husband better spoil. Me. <laughs> that was what you said. He said my husband better spoil. Husband is daddy, boo boo. Daddy spoils you. He buys you. What all did he buy you yesterday? He bought donut. Two donuts. donuts. Can you give me a donut today? No, we can't. 
<laughs> you lost your everlasting mind. So today, this I don't even know how this vlog is gonna be because I don't even know when I started recording. Oh God. <laughs> Jesus be a Xanax. So look, can you be still for a minute? Can you be still? Got on the orange, and we got on the the gray pin straighten orange bow tie. The bow tie did make him is a little heavy, if that makes sense. It's a little weighted, so it's tilting forward. Um, I think I know what the problem is, y'all. This bow tie has become a science to me. Now let me show y'all what I'm wearing. Dress is a sheath dress slash wiggle dress. Um, and my seamstress, she took it in for me. Y'all, Yeah, it may, it may seem like I'm losing weight, but really, I don't show my figure a lot. I wear a lot of clothes that are a little bit baggy. Yeah, but weight. Am I losing weight? High five, JB. So yeah, this You're is what we got. It, actually. Okay, you know what? Purse I'm carrying this. So let me show y'all what um, the whole ensemble looks like. Oh, I guess I could show you. Baby, you're rocking the thingy. This is my hair. A uh, old nasty old twist out. Nasty old twist out because you're Get out of the way. <laughs> All right. And these are the shoes I got from the Goodwill for six bucks. Isn't that cute? And this is what Miss Jackson is wearing. Yeah, so when I get that reduction, I mean, my, I'm not going to look as curvy, but I won't look as top heavy, too. Excuse the mirror, y'all. So, yeah, that's what we wearing today for church. This child. Come on, baby, let's go. Hey, you guys, I'm out of church. Let me try to turn this down some, but it is hot. I'm trying to turn down. Ooh, my Aries 105 inside this car. Um, church went great, but wait a minute. I'm gonna have to pray for this man. As I was leaving church, I, I had to go to the bathroom, girl, because my girl just started cutting off circulation. <laughs> and I went, um, was going out to go pick up JB. As I was walking out the door, I heard someone say, excuse me, ma'am, and I turned around, and it was a man who had my earring. One of my earrings had fell off, and I noticed it was kind of loose, but whatever. And, but why did he say, as he hands me my earring, I shouldn't have been staring so hard? Oh, no, he said, I shouldn't have been looking at you so hard. On church ground, you, you gonna admit to that? Y'all, I'm not wearing this dress ever again to church. <laughs> ever again and I know I kind of switch when I walk I can't help it that's just how I am girl even in jeans I switch when I walk when I walk Lord let me go get some gas and hush up y'all